This is the calculator program called Lottery. This is what I use each day at the beginning of class to hold a uh, lottery, which is why the program is called Lottery. Uh, first of all, the number of seats that are in use in the class. For example, if there are 24, I would enter 24, and then the program feeds back the five seats in the class that would be the winners for the seating chart lottery. And then for the 1 to 30 lottery, it spits back five numbers. And for the squares on the table, it spits back five numbers. It also picks a number from 1 to 6 for the colors red, yellow, blue, green, pink, and orange. And in this case, 1 pertains to red. We'll take a look at the code that goes along with this. So we'll go to Edit and then scroll down to Lottery. First, we clear home and then display seats. This is going to be a prompt to ask the user to display or to enter the number of seats we want to use. There's the input for it. And then we clear home in order to output all of the numbers. First, we output seats for a title, and then the line below that, we output a random number from 1 to S. S was the input for the number of seats. And then we output 1 to 30, and below that, a random number from 1 to 30. We choose five of them. And then the table squares is an output that contains a random number from 1 to 32, and it's generated five times. And then last is a color that is generated from 1 to 6.